All right, we just landed at Charles de Gaulle in Paris and our first order of business is getting connected to cellular data. And we really love using eSIMs when we travel abroad to avoid all those extra fees on your cellular plan. And we really like using eSIMs from Airlo. It's super easy to use. So if you haven't used Airlo before, follow along and here's how you download and use an eSIM. First, obviously, download the Airlo app and then open it. Airlo is great. You can get eSIMs for specific countries or if you're traveling to multiple countries, you can also get ones for specific regions like Europe or Asia broadly. Uh, we're in France, so obviously we're going to be selecting France. And here you can see all of the different types of eSIMs they have available. And they have a special one right now, specifically for the Olympics. And it's valid for 17 days, which is the duration of the Olympics. And it's 20 gigs of data for only $12. That's pretty great. So we're gonna go ahead and buy it. super simple. All you have to do is accept the terms and conditions and then just pay with your credit card. Once you have your eSIM, you're going to have to install it. But before you do, go to your cellular settings in your phone. And what I like to do personally is turn off my primary cell line just because I don't want to get any extra charges. So I'm better safe than sorry. But theoretically, if you just turn off roaming, you should be good. All right. My cell line is off. Let's install this eSIM. You can view the instructions for how to install. It's pretty simple. All right, my eSIM has been installed on my phone and all I have to do now is activate it. They give you a QR code and it's a little complicated. So we took a picture with Jeremy's phone and then I scanned the QR code with my cell phone. Now we get started. Let's install this eSIM. When you install this, make sure you're off airplane mode. I'm currently on it, so let's get that fixed. All right, here we go. Activate. Just like that, the eSIM has been installed on my phone and it is activated. I have cellular data. This is awesome. And if you want to, you can give it a new nickname, France. That's what I'll call it. And that's it. Super simple to get connected when you're traveling abroad. Well, we've got one more thing to do. We have to get our public transport passes. And for the Olympics, you can do this through the Paris Public Transport app. It's really easy to use and you can buy a Navigo pass for one through seven days and it'll let you get from the airport into central Paris and then all around Paris zones one through five. After you buy it, you can add it to your phone wallet and all you have to do to enter the station is tap and go. To avoid all those, to avoid all those, what, travel charges. Oh, I have so many eSIMs and they don't just delete themselves. <laughs> Scan the QR code by printing out or displaying the code on another device to install your eSIM. Well, that's stupid. Scar show. What? Scar show. Well, we've got one more thing to do. We have to get our public transport pass. You can. It's really easy to use. Okay. It's really easy. 